Now that you've imported the marketing data set and are familiar with it, let's do some initial exploratory analysis. To begin, let's get a sense of how many unique users see our marketing assets each day. We can use the group by method on the marketing data frame. To group by date, we pass the date served as the argument to group by. Next, we select the user ID column outside of the group by and use the nUnique method to count the number of unique users per day. Looks like about 300 users each day see our ads. As you saw on the previous slide, it's not easy to interpret results when they're printed in a table. It's much easier to notice fluctuations in our metrics when we plot them. We first import matplotlib.pyplot as PLT. Then we plot the series daily users. It's good practice to always add title and labels to your plot in order to clearly convey what information the chart contains. You can add a title using plt.title and add x and y labels using plt.xlabel and plt.ylabel functions respectively. We also rotate the x ticks, in this case the date labels by 45 degrees to increase legibility. Finally, don't forget to include a call to plt.show to display the plot. As you can see, the first half of the month sticks around 300 users per day. There's a huge spike in the middle of the month. This may be because we sent out a big marketing email, which reached many users who are not daily visitors of the site. These are the kinds of fluctuations we want to be aware of before diving in and calculating metrics. Now, it's your turn to analyze this data.